Hello and welcome to WPLMS updates. In the latest 2.3 update, we have added a feature called registration forms. Using this feature, you will be able to create registration forms for any user type in your WordPress site. So for this, you need to log into your WordPress admin panel. Go to LMS settings. In the general settings tab, you will see a link to registration forms. We can click on this, on this link. And you will see a notice notification to create a new registration form. So we'll create a new registration form by clicking on the add registration form link. And here we'll type in the name, for example, so here we have created the form instructor registration. And below this, we'll see all the custom profile fields that we have created. For example, name, location, bio, Facebook specialty for each of the field groups. So these custom profile fields and the profile field groups we can create in the users profile field section. So as you can see I have created here three profile field groups base social profiles and instructor and you can see that we have base social profiles and instructor and inside each of these field field groups we have few fields such as name location bio and we have name location bio so this is the name of the field and beside this it uh, it is the description which tells us the type of this field so for example facebook is a url type field twitter is a url type field so similarly you can add more fields into any of these field groups. So for example I have added a new field called subject and if I reload our registration form we can see that we have a subject field type subject field in which is of the type radio and we can select if we want to link this field type to the instructor registration form so once we have selected the profile fields for the form we can check the settings so here we can select various settings for this particular form for example this is a instructor registration form so we will define a default role of instructor so anyone who is signing up using this form will be assigned the user role of instructor so you can you can add a google captcha field you can show the field group labels if you want to you can show a password meter similarly you can hide the username field and automatically generate the username from the email and you can skip the mail ver verification so once we have saved all this and we can also register and log in the user simultaneously note that for google capture we will need to enter the google captcha key the google captcha public key and the private key here and you can use this links on how to get the google captcha public and private key otherwise it it will not appear so for this demo i'm removing it so now once all the settings are saved and we have connected all the fields with this registration form we can simply copy the registration form short code and place it anywhere for example we will if we place this form in the hello world so we can use it in inside visual composer or page builder as well and when we view this 
so if I'm not logged in and I open this page I can see the form and I can fill the details here and since in the settings we had enabled the register and login simultaneously we have now logged in so that's it from WPLMS tips thanks for watching